What's up, YouTube? So, in this video, um, I'm going to be talking about Cleveland Farrell, the uh, rookie defensive end for the Oakland Raiders. Um, you know, their first round pick. He's right over here on the left hand of this, on the left side of the screen. Um, this play is pretty simple. I'll go ahead and show it to you. There's something I'd like to point out with him. Actually, a couple things. One thing I do like is he got his left arm because Cleveland Farrell's got some long arms. Um, he got that left hand inside of the offensive lineman's chest, so that'll keep him at bay. But with his right arm, he's defeating this offensive lineman's left hand, and he's going to swipe that down so he can try to go after Joe Flacco. However, right after getting past him, he realizes that this is a screen. The offensive, I mean, the uh, the guard here is starting to pull out to the left, and the tackle that he just got off of is now going to the left, and the running back is getting free. So he knows the running back is about, is about to get the ball right here. So he starts moving toward the running back right away. Now, one thing I would like to see him work on, because he did read this in time, and he's actually pretty athletic, he sees Joe Flacco pumping. I'd like to see him jump in front of this ball and either pick it off or, no or knock it down. But either way, he makes a decent read, and he makes a tackle, so... Can't be too mad at him there. But, like I said, with his athleticism, he probably could have got to that ball and either intercepted it or, pit, or uh, at least knocked it down and made it an incomplete pass. But it is what it is. Um, let me go ahead and uh, find the next one here. All right, so um, on this one here, he's landing up right here. And uh, he's going to be on the tight end. This is a running play. Philip Lindsay is going to be running it this direction. And one thing that I really like from this play is that he um, he uses his hand to keep the tight end at bay. But at the, the whole time, he's keeping his eye on Philip Lindsay and making sure he doesn't break out. Like right here, his eyes are already on Joe Flacco and Philip Lindsay to, to try to read the field read the play he's got his eyes on them as he's getting away from this tight end he's got his right hand right inside the tight end's chest so he knows he's got him that left hand is probably working on his arm so if uh this if joe flacco keeps it he can just rip through and try to go get the sack but he sees that it's a run so he keeps his eyes on him and now he's starting to fight he sees philip Lindsay trying to go outside so he's, he's trying to fight with the tight end here but Lindsay cuts back inside little bit so he's just going to quickly disengage with this tight end and turn around and help with the tackle good play good play um one of the plays here was just a penalty so i didn't bother talking about it so it was just neutral zone infraction nothing really to talk about there so let me go ahead and find the Okay, now this play is actually very interesting to me, just in a scheme situation. As you see, he's not over here. He's not actually on the edge. They actually got him in at three tech right now, and that's actually pretty interesting. Um, I'd like to see them do that a little bit more. I'd like to see what he can do in B-gap. Just uh, beat the guard, and it's going to be a one-on-one -on -one situation pretty much every time for him at that position. This is probably like a nickel set, most likely. That's probably why he's in at three tech. Uh, I don't see no, I don't see another linebacker, so yeah, probably nickel. Let me go ahead and slow it down though. Um, not bad on that one, but good ball get off. As you see, he's uh, he's taken off before. I think that's Arden Key right there. He's taken off first, so he's got he does have pretty good ball get off. That is one good thing about Cleveland Farrell. Gets off the line pretty quickly. Um, right away, he's got his, he's got his left hand inside and he's starting to work. And now that he's got his left hand inside, he's going to bring this hand over. And he's just going to rush right through. But the, this whole time, he's still got his eyes on Flacco. And that, that's one thing I like about him is he is pretty aware. And he's just going to get his hand up. He's just going to bat that thing down. Very good play. And I definitely like the idea of putting him at three tech at times. Move him around the field. Don't let them get comfortable. Def I definitely like that idea. So, yeah. Let me go ahead and find the next play. 
All right, now this one, I'm I'm a big fan of this play. This is the uh, this is the sack, and this is just fantastic. I already slowed it down for it for you. Uh, sorry, uh, that's a weird ass sound. I'll just that's my cat. Sorry, <laughs> I got distracted. Um. Met so much shit in the background. Okay. And now the play is broken. Fantastic. My bad on that one, y'all. Let me get it back to that view. Let me pause it. Slow that down again. But actually, I kind of paused it at a good moment. Because as you see, his... um. You can see his left hand locking up this wrist. And also, they moved him to the other side again. They had him over on the left, but they they moved him at, to uh, they moved him to three tech, and now they got him rushing on the other side. So it seems like they're moving Cleveland Farrell around a lot, so they can't get used to where he's at. And I'm a big fan of that. But as you can see, he's controlling this offensive lineman's wrist, so he can't get a good hold of him. Um, and then here, the uh, the right guard is going to come in and help try to block him. And uh, I, I love that Cleveland Farrell just doesn't give up on this play. One thing I don't like, this isn't on him. But as you can see, he's got his hand on on the, uh, on the 68's arm here. But 68 kind of gives up on the play here. He just kind of... And, and Actually, no. Cleveland Farrell just uses that arm to spin him around, and now you're just going to go around back of him because can't block him if your back is turned and he's just gonna go and get the sack good job finishing it's a really good job big fan big fan of cleveland farrell there um there's one more play here all right so on this one here um they definitely do like moving him around a lot because they moved the de the, the uh d tackle into b gap and he's he's almost playing one at this point um, so that's interesting, but this, this is another good play from him right here. The goalpost kind of in the way, but it is what it is. But as you can see, he's, um, he, he started off by faking like he was going to go, um, to the guards outside shoulder here, but he's actually faking to go inside. And right now he's locking up this guy's, the 65's left wrist. And then... Once he's got it, he's just going to pull that thing down, and then he's going to use his own left arm to just swim over the top, and he's just going to blow right past him. Just swipe that hand down, and just going to go just right for Joe Flacco. He doesn't get the sack, but he does He does uh, pressure him. Still complete pass, but he still did a great job. Um, God damn it, Cat. What the fuck are you doing? Sorry. <laughs> Um, but overall, I'm kind of surprised how much the Raiders are moving him around, but I like it a lot. They're, they're, I seen him play all four positions on that defensive line in this film session. And I, that's very interesting to me. Uh, he only got the one sack, but I liked what I seen from him. Uh, he was fighting with his hands and he was winning those battles. He, um, he was making some pretty good reads and, uh, Overall, just had a just had a pretty good game, especially for uh, his rookie debut. So, yeah, I think that's gonna be it for this video, though. Um, if you liked it, I would appreciate you hitting that like button. If you have any questions or comments, leave in the comments down below. Subscribe if you haven't already. Um, share if you want to. Hit that bell notification if you haven't, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.